Meantime, the Liberty Flames coming off a record-setting 30-win season on the hardwoods. Our own Brooke Leonard caught up with Coach McKay on the season and its abrupt end to believe that it hasn't even been a month since the Liberty Flames won the A-Sun championship and punched their ticket to the NCAA tournament. Yeah, well, winning the A-Sun championship, Brooke, was uh, obviously jubilation and having had a team that was uh, very mature, but also really experienced and had high expectations on them. But within a week, the highest of highs quickly turned with the news of the NCAA tournament being canceled. We, we and we shared it with our guys that night, that Thursday evening, uh, and they they handled it incredibly well. It, it just shows the character of young men that we were afforded the privilege to coach. So there's way bigger concerns and the health and safety of uh, those that we love, those that we don't know, and the unbelievable sacrifice of uh, the frontliners, our doctors, nurses, and those in the medical field. While the circumstances are understood, it was a heartbreaking finish for four seniors who put Liberty basketball on the map. The shelf life that the seniors, uh, what they accomplish will live long in Liberty basketball and we're very thankful that they're a part of our university. But looking ahead to 2020, Flames fans can find comfort in the fact that McKay is still assembling a team of champions. Really it's just to stay connected with our guys uh, we, we like our team, we like the young people that are a part of Liberty Basketball and our university. And we'll, we'll just wait and see when we get through this, going back and again, I think uh, we hope, just hope to continue on that upward trajectory that we've had over the course of time. In Lynchburg, I'm Brooke Leonard, 10 Sports.